actually low percent on legacy can be much faster than on current patch. Like you can skip the elder kettles opening intro. You can get the Hilda glitch. You have a few hidden hitboxes you can use. I'll go to the right. Because why not? Yeah, it just shot backwards. Well, that was a useless, uh, a useless pairing. Yeah, that was like two seconds worse. First, it's a good, uh, it's a good one. I'm gonna get the berries just for safety, but I don't think you need them to get the face to skip. Dude, I might miss it actually. Yeah, I'll, I'll definitely miss it like this. I'll try, but oh, nice. Good RNG. Okay, pretty much one of the best fights at level 4. Almost. Because I think my best is 113, and if you get the skip with less flies, you can probably get it faster. I think. I, I don't remember. Uh, I did not pay attention to how many flies I got here. So I might be wrong. But I just remember getting 113. That's what I'm basing it off of. Here's a real high Now it's if I can get the glitch. If I could get that, um, that would increase my chances by a lot. Because I haven't played low percent in a long time. So I don't really see myself getting a low 32 or whatever. Like I could when I actually practiced it. So 
to, you know, an 8 seconds time save here would be amazing. Is that 10? Uh, I'm gonna try and kill a few minions. Uh, I don't think I'm gonna get it. Well, definitely not. Whatever. I know I can get the record even without it very easily, but... Well, being such a help. One of seven. This is easily one of the weirdest fights in the run. I'm gonna bury that. I don't care. I know it's slower. I just wanna get rid of it. Oh, that doesn't hit. Uh, what was the strategy for Muffin? I'm trying to go over Baroness's fight, but can't quite remember. I think I just dodged. Oh, maybe they're not. I don't know. Any clue? Okay, no muffin, so I don't have to worry about that. I think if I use three, I could. Oh, I, I remember getting a quick kill or whatever. Oh, yeah, and this is the last phase. Uh, I actually have to go through it. I cannot cheese it, like with weapon swap glitch. Dang. Okay. Uh, 115 is really bad. A great slam and then 
Also, I have no idea whether it, uh, this is for like or face or not. I think it's gonna be close. Because I kinda know low, percent, low percent times. So I have a general idea of what my pace is. I think if I keep this pace, I should get around 32, 40, which is the world record. But if I want to beat it, I should get better than that. So I need to speed up a bit. No, oh, whatever, I'm gonna get the nuke anyway. No! <sighs> One to the right. With the trash can. Uh, I think I'll take that. I mean, I don't have alternatives, right? <laughs> Yeah, this is definitely going to be close if I keep this pace. I know I'm I know for a fact I'm not gonna cut that run. So this is not going to be a low 32 if I keep going like this. We'll see though. I kinda did it wrong. Okay, so for low percent it's actually better to use the axis on these pillars. Oh, I just hit that one. And I'll just destroy the remaining ones. Because I want to keep one EX for the start of this sarcophagus phase. Right here. I'll try to stay far away. That was not good, I think. Like, I shouldn't have used the axe there. Whatever, even if I get hit. There we go. The axe I'm shooting down there. Um, so basically, there is a hidden, a hidden hitbox which is stored down below, right there. So basically, this wing from the final phase that is stored to the bottom, and I can just hit it. Unfortunately, since there's a ground in between. Um, Normal shots don't go through, don't go through the ground, but the shooter reactors actually do. So instead of using them on bosses, I'm just using them down there during phase transitions.
Good. Oh yeah, Grim was a difficult fight. I remember that. I wanna try and play it safe if, po uh, if possible. Oh, I can probably cheese it on Legacy. Can't I? If I have 3 HP, I'll try it. Ah, I was trying to bury that. You can probably choose to fight in phase 3. Hey, at this point I will not go for babies. Okay, so this is normally a really difficult fight. On current patch, um, Grim's Nets actually have an hitbox, so you cannot do that. But this is the 1.0 version. AKA Legacy. Not paying attention to the screen. Don't do that. I don't have to deal with the plane. 57. This was a really good fight. Yeah, robot glitch technically exists, but I cannot do that because I don't have bomb access. Can I get it? Yes, that's legendary. Um, sometimes you can get an EX stuck between those two parts. That's really rare. But when you get that, that's so much better. That's so good. Ooh, but I'm not gonna have the new. Uh... Oh, that was no. Did that then he acts a bit late. I haven't done this uh, phase on Legacy in a long time. No berries. Oh, 
All right. Uh, sadly... Yeah, the only thing that's... Is that I have access to the Eden box. That's different from current batch. I should keep shooting Sally. I forgot that it's not better to immediately keep shooting it because all I can do is do those two be the reaxes and I'm good with that. So I have time. The reason why I switch off Sally immediately as soon as the angels try up is because when that happens she has invincibility. So if I keep shooting her, um, I will not deal actual damage. And that's why I keep uh, instead, start shooting at uh, an hitbox that is stored off screen. But I mean, uh, I don't have any urgency, so I can keep shooting Sally to get extra super cards. Well, I should have saved um, super cards for this thing. I can get a quick kill if I get if I have five super cards before the final phase. Completely forgot forgot about it. Much you too. Good day for a well battle. You're up. Oh, nice. <laughs> That's not as precise as it looks. I can just drop down. I bet the axe is not hit fully. I should have kept. Oh, I should have buried that. That shot backwards. Oh yeah, Briny. I completely forgot about Briny here. And unlike Grim, I cannot cheese Briny's fight. Briny Beer is one of the hardest bosses for this category. That much I remember. I think I went for parries, but I'm not gonna go for them. Oh no. Okay. So I'm gonna get another cycle. Uh... Yes, that, I think that was just barely because I saw the bullets. Now, ah, whatever.
Okay. I'm happy to be done with this fight. I still don't know if this is going to be our record. Also, um, it's really rare to soft lock on Kala without mini bombs, or well, without the weapons swap pitch in general. Especially here on Legacy, where I don't have a lot of period opportunities, so I cannot get another nuke just as I'm about to transition to phase 2, that kind of thing. Also, Cuphead, you have some really good hitboxes. Congratulations. I actually only have two fights left. I know I have three splits, but the definition for low percent is that I have to reach the credits uh, by doing the minimum amount necessary. So, on the devil, I technically have two endings. And I'm just gonna choose to accept the devil's deal and skip this fight. I don't necessarily agree with it, but I mean, you, you still get to some credits when you accept the Devil's Deal, so... You are technically completing the game. That was not good. Uh... No, uh, this is so bad now. Might actually die to the Phantom Express. I'm definitely not gonna get a 2 cycle, not that I really needed it. But man, uh, doing the fight with 1 HP is... something. Ooh, I was worried I was gonna, uh, gonna softlock. Sometimes that phase transition is longer than usual. It just makes me think like a softlock. There is a random soft lock, a soft lock in this fight. After you con complete phase 3, there is a very small chance you can soft lock. And it has a tendency to happen uh, in the worst of moments. <laughs> Oh yeah, one change is, uh, is that I can also do monkey skip from current patch. So I'm gonna do that instead of going for the gate wall. Listen to the sound. It is different uh, if you just use the P-Shooter and a current patch. They change something with the P-Shooter sound.
Uh, I think I can get the world record with this run. Here you go. Yeah, I think it's looking it's looking really good. So that is monkey skip. Normally it's the longest fight in the world, but I can just clip it out of bounds. Dude, okay. And when I do that, I just get an instant knockout. I should be, um, think of it. There you go. The reason why I took damage there intentionally is because now I'm gonna get 0 HP on the result stream and due to that I'm going to save 0.8 seconds. Gotta get every time save I can get. Oh, this is actually going to be my current patch time. It's, I'm not really surprised because doing it on like a is faster. But I didn't practice the, this category in a long time. Okay, this is going to be a manual split. 31.45 Not bad That was good I'm actually pretty satisfied If I did get the Hilda glitch that would be better but... Hey, 